Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 10.5 series. Yes, it is Alpha 10.5 still. <laughs> okay, um, so we did some changes off screen because, or I did some changes off screen because I didn't like how the back looked. So what I did was I duplicated how it looked at the front, and now it's just a Tootsie Roll, I guess. I don't know. Um, here, I'll show you. Okay. So I changed it so it's all tapered in and down and up like the front. <laughs> What a ridiculous CV. Oh my god, you think this far into the game I'd be like uh, making better looking things. Okay, we will make this thing look better. Uh, we just don't have the resources to yet. But I think what we can do now uh, is add some more gear to it. So let's go ahead and we're going to equip a bunch of gear into our bar here. So let's Oh, well, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight stacks. So that means we can do eight in every direction because we need we need uh, six directions of thrusters. So eight in every direction. Okay. Well, let's. Oops. There, we'll just put that there for now. Okay. I think what we'll do, so eight in every direction. Wow. That's going to be all the slots in the back here except for the middle, right? And I think what I want to do with these ones is I want to keep them this design here. So this one here. So let's rotate that. Have that facing. Yeah, because then... It's, it looks like it's supposed to be only a half block in, or, or like one block in instead of two blocks in. Yeah. So that went in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like the look of that. I like the look of that. And then we can like... I actually really like the look of that. That looks kind of cool. Uh, that's, that's not bad. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's get the other ones in. Okay, so that's the eight in the back, and then, so the eight in the front I'm not really sure about. Huh, and then the ones on the sides, these are all difficult choices, and I have to do things to my ship. To put these thrusters in so on the sides what I'm thinking yeah these aren't airtight are they airtight true oh Okay, well, I didn't know they were airtight. That, that's a freaking game changer, that is. Um, okay. Well, if that's the case, I can line these up right here. So we can do... How do we want these? <clears throat> so we got to go... We're going to go two in, right? Should we do the top? and We did the bottom. That would look interesting. So if we did... So 
So if we did these blocks right here, let's take a look. It, it, it's it's a long, hard, painful decision. <laughs> Let me tell you. Okay, so we want we get eight in, eh? So what do we got across here? Three, six. We want to put four in. <clears throat> So if we do two there, then two there. Okay, so now let's pop these out. So what I'm saying is two there, two there. Because this is going to be garden, right? That's going to be garden. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to have grow plots right there. Okay, this will work. This will work. And then we do... Two. I know the I know the angle thrusters are going to look funky because they're not going to actually um, they're not going to line up properly, but that's okay. That's okay. We're going to have three, three. Okay, that's fine. I could have moved everything in one, I guess, and had only one in the middle. No, but then now, see, now we can put like um, <clears throat> a turret 3 wide. Yeah, okay, okay, that's better. This is good. This is good. We'll do this. Oops. Let's grab more. There's, uh, well, there's enough. Okay. So we want these ones but we want to change to put that around to there and oops, spin it to like that so it's going to be a little bit up oh, oh, I didn't want to drop it bump the uh, bump the uh, Z or X there by accident uh, let's try that again <laughs> okay so go like this, and then we flip that, and then we go like that. So we want to place these. You can see that they don't 100% line up. That's okay. I think it'll look cool. Anyway, yeah. See, they're kind of half. They're half exposed. That's not too bad. Okay, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. So let's uh, put these ones in. Oops. And we want to change to that and rotate to that. Okay. So there's our eight on the front. So back and front are done. Now the sides, the sides. So I think we could do something interesting up top here with the sides. Could have done that with the front too now that I think about it. And we're going to need up and down, which will be on the sides here, too, for the turret. So turrets on the top. We got here six. But then we can we can do we can go all the way along. That's not a big deal. Okay, so if we if we taper up see now the problem is is this taper doesn't match what the ship taper is. So I'm gonna have to change taper. This is a one to one taper on on this engine. Um <clears throat> 
you know it'd be nice if they had these that had a taper all the way from the front to the back yeah a two block taper wouldn't that be cool okay well we don't have that so how should we do this how should we do this? Should we go? Should we go something really weird, like um, make four turret? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Now I think I, I think I know what we're gonna do here. Okay, let's flip that around. Let's spun. Okay, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to build some some turret housings. And have thrusters sticking out of them. We can do... Is that going to work? I just want to make sure that's going to work. Because we do that one angle there. Yeah. It's going to be a different angle here, but that's okay. So we're going to go like this and oh, be out of. Let's grab more. Okay, get that flipped. You know, I I don't know what the arbitrary decision on six. Like, why don't why don't they let us stack like sixty? When you're doing large builds like this, it actually is a little bit annoying. So we're gonna do three like that, and then we're gonna do the same thing back over here. Yeah, I know. This is not really an optimal build. This is starting a starting CV from scratch with pretty much scrounged parts. So it is what it is. Okay. And then... That's only six, though. We need to get two more on each side. Do we do that um, with one in the center somehow? I'm not sure now. We'll see if it even needs the eight on the sides. Maybe it doesn't on the sides. Pretty sure on the bottom it's going to, though. This is going to be more difficult, doing the bottom. Okay. So, I'm thinking we punch through. So if we do along the back here, so if we punch through right here, so what I mean by punching through is, let's see, we go here and here. What's up there? Just another block, right? So if I, yeah, so can we take that out, 
that out and that out. Okay, okay. Okay, I think I think I know what I can do here is if we one two there's a space one two three there's a space ah maybe not this might not work okay let's take a look here let's take a look here so we want we don't want to start invading this space do we necessarily Man, we only need five. One, two, three, four, five. Couple back here. We don't need there very many. A couple back here. Couple up to the front along the sides. Like seriously, like two. One, one in each corner or something. Because the sides, that's where most of the weight is distributed, can be distributed. That's where I want to put the bulk of them. This would just be for maneuvering, really. Um, trying to decide, should I poke down into this one? You know what? I will. I will. Because then I can go like this. I can put in a... Um, just a regular thruster right there. There, let's pop the other side out. So that's right. One in. So making that flush. Okay. Okay. So this will be much simpler. I think. If we go like this and spin that around. Like that. Now let's go take a look at what it looks like outside. Let's fill that back in. Or here, let's go look over on this one. I like that. That actually looks awesome. I like how it's counter tapered like that a little bit. It gives it some contrast. It's not so flush. Um, yeah. Okay, so let's do the top. Did we not? We didn't do the top there. Okay, that's fine. So we'll do this one. It's going to be this block then. Okay. That's fine. That's one in. Right there. Okay. So same thing for this one. Let's yeah, it's these real thin. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's you know what? It's all engine compartment back there. We are out of box. Like, come on. There we go. Let's get these in here. Obviously, I'm putting in thrusters right now is apparently what I'm doing. So might as well. I'm going to need these two. Let's just put them, stack them. Okay. Perfect. And just put, come on. Look at the sidewall. And then I can put it down all the way. There we go. There, that doesn't look so bad. That doesn't look so bad. 
Okay, so let's fill that back in. Yeah. Put a block there. That was, how many blocks was that? It's a block there, there, and there, and then we'll smooth that off with that. And There we go. All right, so two up, two down at the back. We've got our side thrust, and then we still need more up and down, but that's all going to be right here. So three thrusters right here. And, hmm, okay, hang on. <sighs> okay, so I've already got my front thrust in. I don't need to do that. But I want to keep the taper. So what do we got here? One, two, three, one, two, three. It doesn't work. We don't have the right amount. Oh, yes, we do. Oh, wait, this works perfectly. This works perfectly. Look at this. Okay, so we'll just go like this. I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Okay. And we do that on the bottom. That's these ones. And those pivoted. Okay, so that's eight up, eight down. Oh, we were going to do ten, weren't we? That's why I still have four left. Like, why? Well, yeah, I, I think I wanted to do ten up and ten down, because then that's... So we have... Six on either side. That's where these extra four are. Now, I could put these in, but I think, I think I'd rather do them down and up at the back here. Let's do, let's do two more spots, right side by side, I think, because then that'll give us space. And you one, two, three. Right there, it comes to there. I'm just measuring we need five by three by two. So that'll give us, yeah, that'll give us space if we do it right there. Okay, let's do it right there. Then all the way down. Okay, and we'll stick those in. And that will be facing that way. No. Yeah, that way. So, boom, and then let's flip that around, 
and boom. Okay, let's take a look. Cool. Oh, I think my uh, my water generators all just ran out of fuel. <laughs> I'm like, what what just turned off? Okay, so I think that's all the thrusters in. Nice. So now, see, it's not going to be so boxy. It's not going to be so boxy. What we're going to do is we're going to build little little spots for the turrets to go in. So let's get that. What we're going to do is we're going to convert to the one by one angle. And go like this. Boom. And we can do that over here. Oh. Wait, how are we going to do that one? That is... Will that work the same way? Yeah, that'll still work like that. If I go like this... Yeah, this is still the right, this is still what it needs to do. And then I go like this and flip this one like this and then spin it like that. There we go. Cool. Okay, that does not look so freaking boxy now, does it? Okay, so now this is going to be straight up these ones all the way down. There, we're going to put the bottom angle one pieces in the bottom. Um, but here, let's finish this off. We can put that here. that okay eh. it's probably still going to be ugly as sin but at least it won't look completely like a box I like the thrusters like that the count the double against each other kind of kind of trippy. I like that. You know, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. I've seen worse. Okay, so if we grab the guns. Three, I know we've got some, yeah, three made. Got to see if we can make more of those. Okay, we want the, we want cannon turrets, but we want the retractable. Let's spin that. And then I want that facing forward, like that. Yep. Okay, and then I got to make another one because we're going to have to make one for up here. I'm going to have to make three more, or at least one more anyway. So we'll put that there. And then we'll continue the...
This goes down on the bottom. Got that. Okay, so the sides are done. It's just the top one here. And then, so it's going to come up. So let's flip that. Spin it. Like that. I mean, it, I could. There's going to be five blocks in between each turret, which is good because later on I could, I could. That means I can raise a centerpiece up, and um, and have like an artillery turret. But for now. Let's do this. So that should be mimicking it. Yep, good. Okay. Always got to double check. Sometimes the the uh, symmetry plane does stupid things with the blocks. Okay. And. That in, finish that off. That. Oh, I kind of, hmm. Ah, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll smooth this out right now. I might change this later, but we'll see. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Got a little bit away from me there. Starting to get a little big. Okay, so let's jump down and we'll make, see if we can make another, um, I like the thruster sticking out the back, like, actually, <laughs> looks really raw. I like that. Okay. Uh, anyway, let's see if we can make... Oh! Crap! Here, let's get rid of our symmetry plane for now. <laughs> and we'll finish off the episode by defending the base. And our CV that we're building. Okay, which way are they coming from? It does look like a big box. Well, not when we get the turrets in. It won't be so boxy. Come on, which way are you coming from? They, oh, they're... They come from a different direction every time, it seems. Okay, so let's... let's... Kill them before they can do anything. Now, did I get a message saying my... I'm successful? No? Well, I think we're successful. <laughs> uh, yeah. They really can't. Uh, this is a, a level zero planet, I think. Here, right, let's land. Jump out. We'll take a look. Ow! I can stub my toe jumping over my plane. Guess I better go heal up then. Okay. What does it say? Yeah. Attack difficulty of zero. I mean, I'm not sure if we're if we're gonna get this much. We might be able to get it up to size class two but I just can't see us really getting 
anything that's going to challenge us here at this point at all in the way of base attacks. So I think I want to pack up a move as soon as possible. Because we're just not... I mean, now that I got the SV up and going, my base didn't even shoot. Okay, well, uh, as the sun goes down here, I'm going to call it an episode. So we've got a good chunk done on the uh, CV here. We've got all the thrusters in. We've got, uh, oh, 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 right, before we sign off. Let's see if we can make ourselves a CV turret. Projectile turret CV. Yep. Yeah, we should be able to. <laughs> should be able to make a whole bunch. We should be able to make two more, actually. Let's do that. What's it using? Capacitor device oscillators. Oh, capacitor device, I think, just use oscillators. Yeah, wow. Okay. So we'll get those installed. And I guess we'll call it an episode then. <laughs> So if we stand right about here, I know that it's already getting long in the tooth, but uh, we'll get these installed and then we'll call it an episode. The next episode is more or less fleshing out the center bits. So let's, let's HV, there they are. Nope, that ain't going to work. Let's connect to base. Okay, so we want the retractables and right there. Okay, and then so that's going to be one back right there. Let's turn this around so it's facing to the back. And right there. Oh, I forgot to turn my symmetry plane on. Ah, not a big deal. There's not much left. Not much left. We don't necessarily need a symmetry plane. Although it doesn't take much to put one on. Let's do that. <laughs> right there. Okay. And now let's finish it off with the blocks. Okay. And like that. Like that. And Okay. I'll fill that in with these. And almost done. There we go. That thing is as ugly as sin. Okay, let's turn the symmetry plane off. And we'll get a better look at it. Huh. It's functional. It's functional. Six to either side. Should, should move it sideways fast enough. I don't think we'll have to put in 
the extra ones. The eight front, back, top, and bottom should be sufficient. We might actually have to throttle that back. It might be overkill. Uh, so we can throttle that back by putting in a different grouping for uh, extra thrusters, and then uh, we don't have to have them all running that way at the same time. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to call it here. Uh, next episode, we're going to continue working on this thing. We're going to get the interior fleshed out and, and probably done. Uh, and it'll probably be flyable at that point. So we need to move this. That's going to have to move. We'll probably like bury it here or something. I don't know. I don't know. We bury it back here. So the, the warp is going to fit there. Oh, hey, let's try building a warp drive. <laughs> Do we not have one? I don't think we have one. We do not have one. We have RCS. We have a large T2. That's fine. No warp. No pentaxid. Right? That's for sure. Just double checking everything because I'm stupid. Okay, and obviously nothing on that. I don't think there's anything in here. There, there'd be nothing that it could carry anyway. I need to look at. And one last thing is the whole mole. Nothing in there. Okay. Yeah, okay. So. Let's see, can we make one? Yep. There it is right there. So we'll make a warp drive. A taxi tank. God, we can even make a hull polarized hull shield. It's because of all these flux coils and um and oscillators that we picked up. We're able to make all this stuff now. Yeah, awesome. So that is a 6226. That really sucks. That's longer than the um, warp tank. Okay. Well, we might actually salvage that and put some smaller ones in because that's 50K, that's 500K. That uses 1K. And we've got, what, eight times, we've got 48 of them. Actually, not even. We've got... Um, um, 44 so almost one medium one could could power us you know what two of the large standard t1 generators are going to be sufficient for that for us i'm pretty sure what's the warp tank take five five not even not even a k Like five, <laughs> right? And all these other, that's what I'm saying. All these other things take one and one and, well, it doesn't say because they're blocks. Um, five, like, like minuscule amounts. So I think we can get away with, with nuking this down. And making two of the large ones. So let's make two large ones. And we'll throw that into the salvage. Because that's overkill. That's for like insane size stuff. 500k PU? Yeah, that's unnecessary. And in the future, you got to start thinking about that stuff because when the CPU points 
uh, come in to affect, then it's going to suck. But, well, okay, guys, next episode, uh, we will continue on. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.